All right, the question came up on how do you do a Google Hangout on air by yourself or without having anybody else on there. Uh, it's pretty easy to do. You can also embed that video in other pages even before you begin the broadcast. I'm recording this. I'm going to upload it to YouTube a little bit later so that you'll be able to watch it as well. You'll notice that I'm up here on my Google Plus account, plus.google.com. If you haven't already set up your YouTube account to be able to do Hangouts on Air, which allows you to do more than 15 minute videos, you'll have to go through that process first. As you go through this, it'll automatically prompt you to do that. I've already done it on mine, so you won't be able to see that. So the easiest way to do it is you go to Home. You come down here to Hangouts on Air. It's going to pop up. And you'll notice that there's a button here, maybe a little bit further down the page, that says Hangouts on Air. You click it, and you give it a second to initialize, and it goes through and does all the things it's supposed to. It says you're going to name it. Now, my screen has not got everything, uh, so I'm going to shrink it down so you can see everything. There we go. Uh, so we're going to name it, and this is an IMSF uh, test hangout for demo purposes only. You can notice down here in the bottom, my name suddenly showed up. Now, it says, who do you want to see this, right? Public, your circles, your extended circles, that's who you want. You can put anybody you want to in there. You'll notice it also says that it's connected to my Google Plus account and will be broadcast on my YouTube account. So for those that aren't aware, Google Hangouts on air broadcast through YouTube, record through YouTube, and everything that you do goes through YouTube. So we're going to go on this one and just put public because I want everybody will see it. It says, well, you're not able to invite public or things to hang out on air because it's limited to the number of people that you can do. So we're going to delete public. We're not going to put anything in there. And we're simply going to click start hang out on air. And it'll take it a second. You notice up here at the top, hey, everybody, that's me in my picture. Uh, that in preparing for broadcast. It takes a few seconds to do this because what YouTube has changed over the last couple of weeks is they have an automated uh, encoding system so that when people join your Hangout on air, it's automatically recorded. They can use the scroll functions. They can go back and forth through everything so they can start out just like it's a fully recorded and you don't have to wait. When it gets all the way done to the end, everything's already done. Um, I'm sitting in one of my offices, and you'll notice cell phones and everything else in the back, so just ignore the background. It's not the greatest for this. Um, but when it gets done, you'll notice it says start broadcast. You don't want to do that just yet because what we want to do, the question was, is how do we do the uh, embedding? See this right here where it says embed? Simply click that. It'll give you the embed code that you need. You copy and paste it. You can put it on any website you want. And when somebody goes to that website, all they're going to see is like a blank video. Uh, a YouTube screen looks like a, a VHS tape or something like that. And it won't actually start until you hit start broadcast. Now, once you've hit start broadcast, it'll say getting ready to broadcast. And it's going to take two to three seconds before it gets ready to. And then once it does, it's going to broadcast. Now, um, I'm not going to go ahead and broadcast this because it's just me talking. Um, I guess I could. So that you can see and we'll walk you through. Um, some of the other tools, but uh, we'll do that later. So that's the easiest way to do it. You just hit start. You hit uh, grab the embed code, put it wherever you want to, hit start broadcast, and you'll be good. Uh, there's some really cool apps over here on the left. Uh, the great thing about Google Hangouts is you can try it out and play it. Uh, do a Hangout on Air by yourself, test all the tools, see what it's going to look like. Go watch the replay uh, because there's some interesting things. You can share. Um, tools uh, you can do YouTube videos and things like that and the problem is is that while you're doing them live people can see them people can share them it doesn't record so just something to be aware of uh, all right this is Scott Loving good if you got any questions you can hit me up on Facebook I am the only Scott Loving good on Facebook that I know of uh, don't know of any others. Uh, I'm on uh, Internet Marketing Super Friends uh, in there quite a bit. I uh, also run a group called Webinar Marketing so you're welcome to look that one up as well um, and uh, just so don't know that anybody is turning this on, so you'll see. All right, that's my name, Scott Lovingood. Just look me up on uh, Facebook. Send me a friend request. If you got any comments or anything else, just let me know. Uh, I'll talk to you guys later if you got any questions.